Prince William rejects Meghan's demands for Harry to be co-host leader of 2025 BAFTA Awards. In a move that sent shockwaves throughout the British entertainment industry, Meghan Markle is said to have asked Prince William to allow her husband, Prince Harry, to appear at the prestigious 2024 BAFTA Awards ceremony. This unexpected request was announced as William faced the risk of being absent from the event due to having to focus on taking care of his wife, Catherine, who was undergoing a medical procedure. Before we continue, please subscribe and turn on notification bells for updates. The nominations for the 2024 BAFTA Film Awards have been announced, with Christopher Nolan's highly anticipated biopic Oppenheimer emerging as the frontrunner. Receiving multiple nods, the lack of any nominations for Meghan and Harry's much-typed Netflix documentary series has added fuel to the fire. As the couple's ongoing discussions with the royal family continue, it continues to dominate the headline. Prince William, who has long served as a president of the British Academy of Film and Television Arts, or BAFTA, is expected to preside over the ceremony on February 18th. But with Catherine's surgery scheduled at that time, it seemed increasingly unlikely that it would happen. The future king will be able to complete his mission. Royal commentator Emily Wilkins said, This is a delicate situation for the royal family. William's commitment to his wife and her health is understandable, but the BAFTA awards have enormous significance for both the British film industry and the monarchy's relationship with it. The prospect of a Prince Harry taking power has certainly caused a stir in the palace. Harry's rift with his brother has been well documented, and the idea of him hosting one of the UK's most prestigious cultural events in William's place will no doubt raise eyebrows. Meghan's request is a bold move, and it's clear that she and Harry see this as an opportunity to assert their influence. They've worked hard to establish their own brand and carve out a role for themselves outside of the traditional royal hierarchy, and this could be one way to do that. However, the final decision belongs to the BAFTA organization, which will have to weigh the potential benefits and risks of allowing Prince Harry to step into the limelight. The event's reputation and public perception of the royal family's participation are at stake. BAFTA has always been a delicate balancing act between honoring the role of the royal family and maintaining the independence of the film industry, said media analyst David Ashton. Allowing Harry to headline the ceremony could be seen as a political statement, and the BAFTA board will have to consider the implications very, very carefully. Adding to the complexity of their situation is that William's absence from BAFTA could extend beyond the award ceremony. The prince is also expected to miss some Six Nations rugby matches in February, as well as postponing investiture ceremonies in January and February to focus on supporting Catherine during her recovery. William's duties as a royal are enormous and his commitment to his wife and family is commendable, but the royal family's public engagements are a key part of their role and his absence from these high-profile events could be seen as a worrying sign of tensions within the monarchy. As anticipation grows for the 2024 BAFTA awards, the battle for control of the ceremony has become a microcosm of the growing tensions within the royal family. Meghan's request and the possibility of Prince Harry's involvement has raised questions about the future of the monarchy's relationship with the entertainment industry, as well as the delicate balance of power within the House of Windsor. This is a fascinating moment in the ongoing saga of the royal family. The outcome of this BAFTA decision could have far-reaching implications, not just for the awards themselves, but also for the monarchy's role in British cultural life. This is a high-stakes game, and the world is anxiously watching.